Hey guys, it's Mana, and welcome to Alternative Unicorn, a weekly show where I discuss spirituality, mental health, and airy fairy new age stuff. Today on Alternative Unicorn, we are going to be talking about oil pulling. What is oil pulling, you ask? Oil pulling is a traditional Ayurveda method of tooth care. Um, it involves swishing around an oil in your mouth, either like vegetable, coconut oil, sesame oil, for 20 minutes. Um, with the intent of pulling bacteria out of your mouth. It's supposed to promote healthy gums, prevent cavities, and I've heard a lot of people talking about it and talking about holistic and new healthcare in general, so I thought I would give this a try today. <laughs> I've actually done it before, but today I got it on camera, which was kind of a gross process. Um, but today I chose to use coconut oil, virgin coconut oil from Trader Joe's, and um, you're supposed to do it the first thing that you wake up in the morning before you even drink any water because the conversation around it is that if you drink water right when you wake up, all the bacteria that's been in your mouth from the night before, you drink it. Um, so you swish it around your mouth first thing before you wake up, swish it around for 20 minutes, then rinse your mouth with warm water, and then you can do your regular oral care um, that you normally do in the morning. I'm still just brushing my teeth with some type of pro enamel type toothpaste and I haven't switched over to holistic tooth care in general so this is kind of my first step into that and to experiment with it and see how my mouth responds with it and I wanted to share it with you guys and get feedback and see what some of your experiences are with alternative health care for your mouth. So let me preface this by saying in the beginning why I chose to do it. I do not have a dentist. I have not had dental like insurance or dental health care since I was a minor and lived with my mother and she paid for that. Ever since I turned 18, I stopped having a dentist. Totally something I took for granted and didn't realize well, I really wanted to take this into my own hands and see if I can reverse some cavities or be my own dentist. It's not really something high in my priority and there's lots of articles and things on whatever. That's a whole other video that we can get into is why holistic like dent why holistic dental care so i just kind of wanted to explore some facets with you and see what this experience is like <sighs> sorry about my morning face okay good morning i'm going to demonstrate for you some oil pulling so got my organic virgin coconut oil from trader joe's and a teaspoon I hear that it really helps if it's liquefied and I've been doing, I've done this a couple times and I use coconut oil for everything so it's probably about the right consistency um, that you would want it. So ugh. Take about a tablespoon. There we go. So first off, um, I chose coconut oil because it doesn't taste bad. It does taste good and it's hot right now so it was kind of like the good texture that I needed. It can solidify so make sure it's kind of room temp or just not hard. Um, at first it kind of feels normal and it's kind of, it feels good in your mouth and it, the texture is really nice, it's really velvety, the taste isn't really terrible. Then about like, I'd say, five minutes in it starts <laughs> it starts to get kind of awful and um, I read some blogs and some articles that gave me some suggestions and the first time I tried oil pulling I was doing exactly what the article told me not to do which was read about oil pulling while you're doing oil pulling because it really grosses you out and it was totally true the first time I did it, I can only make it like five minutes um, and truth be told today I only made it 10 minutes so I'm working my way up to a full 20 I have to get myself in the mindset for it and the headspace for it because as you're swishing around in your mouth, bacteria is coming onto your tongue, into your taste buds, and you are salivating. So what starts as like a tablespoon or a teaspoon of oil turns into just like a mouth of saliva and bacteria. It's so disgusting. But I guess better out than in, right? That's kind of the whole point is don't have it in your mouth. Like you want the stuff out of your mouth. My suggestion for anyone that wants to try it is keep yourself 
busy. So for those 10 minutes that I was switching around, I was also picking up my bedroom, I was walking around the house, I was just trying to not think about what I was doing, but consistently busy swishing around and swishing around. If you can breathe through your nose, if you have allergies, this is gonna be a tough challenge for you and you might need to like sit and meditate on it. But I kept myself busy and I still only could make it 10 minutes. Um, when I spit it out after the 10 minutes is because I started to get really sick to my stomach and I started to gag a little bit and I'm imagining that's probably because there's a lot of bacteria in my mouth and there's bacteria in all of our mouths but maybe a lot and um, I switched around with warm water I got the oil out and then I brushed my teeth and my teeth were bleeding bleeding I don't know if my teeth my gums but it didn't hurt um, so I'm kind of taking it as a good sign. I brush my teeth every single day, twice a day, and my teeth don't bleed every single day. They actually don't bleed that often. So the fact that my teeth were bleeding after oil pulling is really interesting. So maybe it, it did pull out some stuff. I'm interested in hearing some feedback. There was kind of a lot of blood. Um, but my mouth feels super clean, y'all. Like really, really clean, really nice texture. My tongue feels really clean. Um, and that's something that's really positive. <sighs> so yeah, that was my kind of oil pulling experience. You're supposed to really consistently, I think, for a week to two weeks before you start to see results. I'm going to keep doing that and I will update you on it. I'm sorry I didn't um, do this video after 10 days of doing it, but I kind of wanted to do it before to see what my perception is at the beginning. and talk about does it get easier, does it get harder, so here's my day one of oil pulling and in probably about two weeks I'll update you again on how it's been going. So I hope that you guys like this video. I know it's a weird thing, but I kind of wanted to explore some facets of holistic health care. We talk about holistic mental health care, we talk about all kinds of natural things and alternative ways and why can't melds be the same type of stuff. So if you guys have any products that you'd like me to try, some holistic products, some natural healthcare products, cosmetics, I'm really interested in integrating a lot of this stuff into my life. I think it's really good. I really believe in it um, and it's really easy and really affordable. So that's kind of a lot of my goals is um, keeping it simple and not trying to complicate my life too much with all this like crazy nonsense. And I hope this works. So if you guys have oil pulled or are on a holistic teeth like holistic oral regimen. I'd love to hear about it. I'd love to hear about your experiences. Um, I'd like some advice and tips on how to go about this and I'm excited to share more with you. Thanks so much for stopping by guys. Mwah.